Hi guys and welcome to Daily Scuba News. Today's episode is sponsored by our very own Teespring store, but more about them later, because I want to talk about a new paddy speciality, because this one is spreading around the globe and it isn't really a diving speciality, it's an EFR one. So EFR, for those who don't know, is Paddy's Emergency First Response course that teaches you first aid. You can progress on uh, sort of for your first aid at work and for uh, sort of first aid for children, but course director Holly McLeod has pioneered this new first aid speciality in Indonesia. Now, of course, this isn't the first time we've ever seen this course. Um, there's been a handful of them already in the UK, but Holly's actually introducing the course into her ISC, sorry, IDC curriculum. And the course is the Diving Emergency Medical Responder course or DEMA. So your standard EFR course teaches you primary and secondary care, such as CPR and AED use, but it isn't focused on diving related ailments. Sure, the Rescue Diver course picks up from where EFR ends and teaches you about different DCIs and stuff, but it mainly teaches you how to get divers out of the water and to paramedics as best you can. DEMA will add another level onto your knowledge and skills, teaching about DCIs in more depth, oxygen toxicity, ear trauma, patent foramen ovale, which is a hole in the heart, uh, immersion pulmonary edema, and other diving specific problems. That way, if you're diving somewhere more remote or you're doing some more extreme diving or even just regular diving, then you can be a better help should anything go wrong. Okay, now for a quick word from our sponsors. So what is the most important things that scuba divers love to do when they're not scuba diving? Well, it's telling people that they are a scuba diver and the most common way to do this is with a cool scuba diving t-shirt. And guess what? Our very own Teespring store features lots of t-shirts, stickers, hoodies, and even socks that will let everybody know that you are in fact a scuba diver. To view our entire range, just click on the link pinned in the comments below. And check out our new Deco Stock t-shirt. It's really cool. Okay, so here's a quick rundown of what the DEMA course covers. And DEMA was originally conceived by thedivermedic.com, who do all sorts of EFR and DAN courses for all sorts of people, whether you're a recreational diver or a commercial diver, they cover all sorts of uh, sort of first aid courses. But back to Holly. So Holly recently certified as a DAN diver medical technician and DEMA instructor. And with this new wealth of knowledge, she figured quite rightly that maybe this heightened level of medical course be more widely available and actually standard in her instructor development course. So that all of the instructors that she signs off are actually now a higher tier medical responder. And if you're interested in becoming a better diver or just want to know more about what to actually do in a diving incident, then check out the DEMA course. If you're a dive master who's been thinking about their IDC but haven't decided where to go, then maybe this might sway your decision. I mean, it's Indonesia, man. There are worse places that you can do your IDC. And uh, you could be part of the next generation of dive instructors because Paddy are constantly updating their curriculum. So if this goes well, then it may become a global thing. Granted, a lot of course directors will have to do the DEMA course, but hey, better instructors, better divers. What do you guys think? Should more in-depth medical training be integrated into professional tier courses as standard? Uh, what's the highest tier medical training you've ever undertaken? Let's discuss DEMA in the comments below. Thank you for watching, and of course, safe diving. Uh, okay, so yeah, we're gonna be talking about killer dolphins, um, but yeah, we couldn't pass up a silly story like this, unfortunately. Um, so put on your tinfoil hats and let's talk about fleets of killer dolphins. Um, so apparently Iran has a fleet of dolphins that have been specially trained to attack enemy ships in a kamikaze